Hi everybody, in this video I want to show you how to do a degree audit so that you can track your degree progress and make sure that you are on track to take the classes that you need to um, get the degree or certificate you're aiming for. All right. So if you go to ghc.edu and you might just type in degree audit into the search bar, click search and then track my degree progress, click there. Okay, and if you could read this, um, again, make sure you have an academic plan from your advisor. Okay, click on student login and put in your student ID and PIN number. Get your student ID and PIN number from my.ghc.edu. Okay. And there are a lot of different types of degrees and certificates listed here. Okay, so if you click on this, you'll see all of them. Okay, and you can actually check um, check any of them, right? Um, the most common degree students are going for would be probably in Associates of Arts. So let's select that degree for this, the current year, wherever year you're looking at, and click Run Audit, and just give it a minute. Okay, and now here we go. Associates of Arts, credits required 90, and credits applied. Uh, this student has 43.5 so far. This is a fake student, don't worry. Donald Duck, not a real student, okay? Um, and so for Associates of Arts, you can see you need 10, uh, two uh, communications courses, one math course, 15 credits of social science, so that's three, three five-credit classes, and uh, 15 credits of humanities, uh, so three humanities, three science, and then six electives, four of which need to be specified, and, and two can be general, right? So um, so that's the degree. Uh, now in here, you can see course options, okay? And it can get a lot, a little complicated because there's a lot of options, but uh, good to explore and read all the details about um, different areas for the different, uh, you know, you got to take one course from each area. And, and again, you need to meet with your advisor and go, go over all this stuff. But it's great to read up on this. Use degree audit yourself and um, keep track of your degree progress yourself, right? So let's look at a different degree. So how about an associate in business direct transfer agreement? Let's uh, have a look at that. Okay, and then you can see different, uh, some different requirements for this degree, right? So we got to take accounting and so on, right? So that's degree audit. It's a great tool to use. I hope you all keep uh, keep on top of your degree requirements.